realistic Galaxy Watch 3 faces are hard to find. So I've compiled a list of my top 10 choices for the best realistic Galaxy Watch 3 faces on the Galaxy Watch store today. Stay tuned and enjoy the video. Hello everyone, welcome back to Tech It Easy. So we've covered a fair few topics now on Galaxy Watch Faces, but I haven't done top 10 realistic Galaxy Watch Faces, so here it is. As always, let me know down in the comments section which one is your favorite. And I have included links to all the Watch Faces this time. Come on, that deserves a like. Also, just before we start, if you are new here, please do subscribe to the channel. There's plenty more content coming. And without further ado, let's jump into the video. So before we get started, it is worth noting that there isn't really that much choice when it comes to super realistic watch faces on the Galaxy Store. Also, watch faces will look a little bit different on the camera. Generally, when I've picked these watch faces out, they have at least one aspect that I consider that makes them realistic. For example, depth and reflections. So with that in mind, this is our first watch face of the episode, the Mosh 47. I often find the simplest watch faces are the most realistic ones. This one has a nice metallic looking dial and has the artificial reflections turned on. Downside to this watch face is of course there isn't any information displayed such as steps, battery and calories counted. One other feature it does have is by tapping on the screen it will change the background to a lighter colour. Personally though, I think this takes away from the realism. It is incredibly simple but super smart and quite realistic. Give it a go and see what you think. For our second Galaxy watch face, we have the Jeweler Predator Yellow. Now again, the camera isn't doing this watch face any justice, but I like the realistic textures and added depth on this one. It is also highly customizable with several different options to choose from. As far as information displayed goes, it has your battery life, steps, time in both digital and analog format. Little tip for you as well, on the watch face, instead of the usual double tap to change the face, it just takes one single tap in an empty area. Might not be for everyone, I appreciate that, but you get a lot of watch faces in one on this one. Let me know in the comment section what you thought of it. Realistic Galaxy Watch number three is a returning watch face from our analog watch face episode. A couple of you commented that you liked the depth in this one and I have to agree with you. It's a shame about the spinning globe though, I think that does make it look a little bit cheap but still it is an incredible looking watch face with so many different face styles to experiment with by doing the usual double tap. There are a few styles that do cover the spinning globe though if you aren't a fan of that as well. Although very small and hard to read, this watch face does pack quite a few bits of information in. Those being battery life in both the top right and the bottom left, as well as a date, heart rate and steps off to the left there. A very detailed watch face with a lot to offer and definitely one of my favourite realistic Galaxy watch faces to date. Watch face number four is the classic Minimal 3. Probably my favourite one of this episode. I do love the simplicity, realism and the fact you get all your essential information on the watch face. That being date, time, battery life and steps off to the top there. Now unfortunately it's not a customizable watch face but I'm okay with that. I love how it is. It does have shortcuts off to the right for your phone and weather though which can come in handy. This is a really functional watch face, very smart and very well balanced in my opinion. Not to mention it looks quite realistic because of all the black space on the watch as well as a subtle shadow on the edge of the outer dials giving it some depth. Give it a go and let me know what you think. In our number five for our realistic Galaxy Watch episode is the new BRG01 by Bergen. Now this watch face was featured on my free Galaxy watch face episode and it's one of my all time favourites especially because it's free and the detail and resolution of the watch face itself alone is enough to make it look realistic but on top of that it also does have a nice inner shadow which gives that illusion of depth. As well as looking incredibly realistic, you will also have the option to change the background colours and also the colours in different zones too, such as where the battery and step style is. Which does bring me on to the information that you get on this watch face. So you of course get battery and steps as I just said, time in both digital and analogue, date, kilometres walked and your heart rate. You also have a quick shortcut to your settings and phone down at the bottom there. Honestly, an absolutely insane watch face. It actually looks like one of the stock ones, but it's not. Do bear in mind, it might not be free when you watch this video. Things do change on the Galaxy Watch Store often. 
Next up is the Matvian Steel Digital Watch Phase. Now, I really wasn't sure whether to include it in this episode or not. It's certainly not as realistic as some of the other watch phases we've shown off today, but there is something about it that really stands out to me. It's super sharp, really high resolution, and really clean. The individual dials you see on the screen do have that artificial reflection, as well as a gradient effect, which sort of makes them pop out the screen a little bit, which does add a nice bit of depth and realism to the watch face. As far as information displayed goes, you get your date and time in both analog and digital format. You have your steps to the left, heart rate at the bottom, and a shortcut to your settings at the top there. This one also is a customizable watch face, so you can edit the colors of the little rings and dials. It's a super, super clean watch face and a really, really high quality. The camera certainly doesn't do it any justice. I think you'll have to see it for yourself to see how realistic it actually is. But for me, it is realistic enough to get into this episode. Try it out and let me know in the comments section what you thought. Next up is the S4U Le Mans. Now, styles for you have a really great selection of high quality watch faces on the Galaxy Store. So they're definitely one of my favorite Galaxy watch face brands. This particular watch face was featured in another one of my previous episodes, and there's a lot to love about it. First off, the realism. It has a really nice shadow around the edge, which again gives it some depth and makes it look like it's sinking into the screen. The dials also have their own shadows too, which really add to the effect. As well as being super realistic, there are also some other options by double tapping on the screen. Although I'm not too keen on the other colors, especially not the flag, that's a bit too much for me. But some of you might actually like it. Aside from that though, the information displayed on this one, you get both your date and time, of course, in analog format. You get your heart rate at the top, battery to the left and steps at the bottom. You also have a little shortcut to your music in the bottom left there, which also has a nice artificial shadow and highlight effect on it. Everything really looks like it's popping out the screen Screen. It's a super, super clean, high resolution watch face, which is yet another thing that really does add to the realism of Galaxy watch faces. Definitely check out Styles For You on the Galaxy Watch Store. Now, next up is probably our most featured Galaxy watch face, and that is the Yang Yellow. It's been featured so much because it's just really a good all rounder. It's a nice, classic, realistic looking watch face with a lot of detail. I appreciate the yellow might not be for everyone, but it does pack a lot of information into the face. So at the top there, we have your heart rate and battery life. Off to the right is the date. At the bottom is your time in digital format. Middle is time in analog, of course. Then also at the bottom there, you have your steps count. And then off to the left is your date. Again, this is another one that has that illusion of depth, and there is also some fake reflections around the outer edges, but they're not interactive. It especially works well with the black Galaxy Watch 3 and the original Galaxy Watch. If you haven't tried this one out yet, do give it a go. I'm pretty sure you'll learn to love it, and I promise the yellow will grow on you. In at number nine, we have got the classic Galaxy Watch face, and it is literally called the classic. Now, best thing about this one is that it is free, and it's probably one of the most realistic Galaxy watches you can find altogether. It's incredibly simplistic, but sometimes simple is best. It's extremely functional, so you can wear it to work or parties or wherever you're going. It does have that artificial reflection effect again, which gives it a really nice bit of depth and realism. Also, the dials and that ring at the bottom have this nice beveled edge look which makes them look like they're popping out of the screen. I especially love the color combination on this one. It does make it feel very special. That and the added realism really does make this one of the best Galaxy Watch faces out there. And that's why I keep featuring it. As far as information display goes, it's just your basic time and then your battery life at the bottom there. You of course do have your date to the right. And I do believe on the original Galaxy Watch, you can swap that bottom dial out and also change the background to a nice blue color or even rose gold. Unfortunately, this doesn't seem to work on my Galaxy Watch 3. I'm not too sure why, but I'm sure something similar will come out in the future. Now, last but not least, we do have the Chromo Circle. Now, I appreciate this one might look a little bit odd and out of place when you first look at it, but when you actually see it in real life, you'll notice that some of the dials and digits are slightly brighter than the rest of them, which gives the illusion of some layers and depth. You'll find that most Galaxy Watch faces with a dark slash black background like this one do look a lot more realistic on the wrist than most of the other bright ones. It's incredibly simplistic, but for those of you who like a lot of information on your watch face, this one could be for you. So at the top, you've got your steps, then you've got floors climbed, then you've got your time in digital format, followed by battery life, date, heart rate, and your distance walked. Then of course, in the middle there, you've got your time in analog format as well. 
I feel like this could be a good sporty watch face or those of you who do actually use a lot of the apps on your watch and are constantly going checking your tracking. Again, it's definitely not as realistic as some of the other watch faces we featured, but it is realistic in its own little way. And I do believe you'll be surprised once you put it on your wrist and try it out for yourselves. Anyway, it's something a bit different and something we've not had on the show before. As always, let me know in the comments section whether you liked it or not. So those are my top 10 picks for the best realistic Galaxy Watch 3 faces. If you did enjoy the video, please do leave a like and a comment. And if you're new around here, please do subscribe to the channel. But for now, take care and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.